Hey, uh, my name's Michael, <clears throat> and I want to <clears throat> do this video on uh, the techniques by which um, anyone, particularly physicians, I think they'd be the most interested to go to the CMS government website and download the uh, 2014 RVU, which is a free service. So. Um, on Google, you can go to cms.gov, and um, which will bring up this website, which many of you may already know about. Um, and in the um, search window for the website, you can type in RVU 2014 search. And it'll bring up a number of pages. And the only one that, um, well, okay, a lot of pages. The what you're interested in is the first one, RVU 14, Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services. And um, this is the physician fee schedule, January 2014 release. The file contains revision identified in the physician fee schedule, final regulation published in 2013. And what some of you may not know is the uh, CPT codes are copyrighted by the American Medical Association. I'll show that to you. So in the download area, you can click here. And on my computer, it shows up as RBU download into a zip file. Maybe yours is different. <clears throat> and on the down, it downloads it of 16 files, count them out, um, of which you're really only interested in one, this Microsoft Excel worksheet. So to, I mean, you can look at them all, but um, I do control A, which, which copy, puts them into, um, uh, selects all of them, and uh, then control hold down the control key and left click on this 1586 KB folder, Microsoft Excel worksheet, and then right click and delete everything else and it'll give you a delete multiple items. Are you sure you want to permanently delete 15 items? Yes. And there it is. And you can open it. It will probably ask you to well, at some point to rename it. And here it is. The One of the first things you want to do is to enable editing, which allows you to edit it. And so this is the uh, 2014 National Fee Physician Fee Schedule Relative Value File from January. The CPT code descriptions and I guess the RVU values are only, only are a copyright 2000 the American Medical Association. And what they would like to do is sell you a very expensive book when you don't really have to. You can have this as your own resource to, um, to look at from a spreadsheet. Uh, and what I do is import it into a database. I use MS Access, and I probably will run another video to show you how to do that. Um, if you look at the what what's in here, there's a quite a number of rows. It's actually, 15,000 more than 15, only six, almost 16,000 rows. And um, you're really not interested in as a physician. There's a lot of extraneous data in here and a lot of extraneous columns. Okay, the one column you are interested in is column A, column C, and column F. Uh, so you can, now that you've enabled editing, you can click here and delete this column. Don't delete that column. This one, delete. This one, delete. Not this one. This is uh, your 
your work RVUs, this is your description, these are your CPT codes. So, so anything from here on, over on here, is, is of not any particular value to uh, physicians who are interested in what their RVU codes are running. Uh, values of so one of the one of a, a technique you can do to eliminate multiple columns is um, alt and a shift and the alt key together and then click across the top let's see click across the top keep clicking Okay, and let go of that, then right click and delete. Great, so you have now deleted everything but the CPT code in this column, the description in this column, and the work RVU here. Now, the first 10 rows you really don't need, and I'm gonna try that technique again, Shift and Alt. Click all the way to the top. Right click, delete, there you go. Okay, so with that, this little floppy disk looking thing is the icon on your ribbon for, for save. So if you click that, you can't save this because it is files read only. To change, you will need to save the workbook with a name or a different location. So let's change the name in a different location on the desktop. And we will call it something else. RVU, RVU, download, 2014. Save that file. That's it. Well, thank you very much. And um, I'll have another series of videos which will show you how to manipulate this data in an access, um, <clears throat> access, let me open this up, just uh, so you'll show it's still there, in an access file or you know, program, which will give you a lot more control. A spreadsheet is interesting, but it's not a, a real database. It's a spreadsheet uh, with a access program. You're able to do quite a bit more uh, in terms of manipulating data and um, I'll show that in the next video. Okay, thank you very much.